which meats, seafood and eggs can help you lose weight in a healthy way. Are there some types you should eat less of or even completely avoid? In this video, I will share my top tips for choosing the best meat, seafood and eggs for healthy weight loss. Plus, I will let you know the number one mistake to avoid when making meat choices. Let's get into it. Hi, I'm Dr. Andreas Jenfeldt, CEO of Diet Doctor, and today I'll be talking about the best meat, poultry and seafood for weight loss. If you've been watching this series, you can probably guess my first piece of advice, which is to aim for a high protein percentage. Getting enough protein helps keep your appetite down and your metabolism up. To lose weight without feeling hungry, eat protein foods that provide the most satiety for the fewest calories. How can you do this? By choosing foods with high protein percentages. A food's protein percentage tells you how much of its calories come from protein as opposed to fats and carbs. A good rule of thumb is to choose meat, poultry and seafood options that are at least 35% protein, preferably even higher. This can help you feel comfortably full and meet your protein needs, all while taking in fewer calories effortlessly. Fortunately, many delicious meat and seafood options have good or even excellent protein percentages. Tip number two, make lean meat choices most of the time. Now this may be controversial for people on a keto diet and to be clear, it can be fine to eat fattier cuts like ribeye and prime rib if you're on a keto diet and you're having success on your healthy weight loss journey. But if you hit a weight loss plateau, you may want to try switching to leaner cuts. For the most effective weight loss, when in doubt, choose lean meat when preparing meals or dining out. With chicken and turkey is easy, although white meat provides more protein per calorie than dark meat. All types are great, breast, thigh, drumstick and even wings. Plus, you can eat the skin no matter which part of the bird you prefer. Now, the protein percentage of your meal will be a little bit higher if you remove the skin. But obviously enjoying your food is important, so if you prefer your poultry with skin, go ahead and leave it on, it really makes no big difference. At Diet Doctor, we have dozens of high-protein chicken-based recipes, including low-carb chicken drumsticks and chicken with olives and mushrooms. We also have a fantastic recipe for keto sheet pan fajitas that includes veggies, olive oil and spices, with a protein percentage of 45%. What about beef, pork and lamb? Here, you will again want to go for leaner cuts to get the best weight loss results. For example, a fatty piece of prime rib is 30% protein, while filet mignon is 61% protein. Both are delicious and can make you feel full. However, the filet mignon provides twice as much protein per calorie. This means you will get only half the calories, but may feel almost as full after eating filet mignon compared to an equal serving of prime rib. Remember, your goal for healthy weight loss is to maximize satiety per calorie. Other great lean meat options include beef sirloin, pork tenderloin, leg of lamb, and all cuts of veal, bison, and other game. The third tip is to eat plenty of fish and shellfish. Having seafood several times a week is a great strategy to boost your protein intake and increase the overall protein percentage of your diet. With a few exceptions, fish and shellfish provide a ton of protein and very little fat and carbs. So for the most part, their protein percentages are excellent. Shrimp is 97% protein. This is the highest protein percentage of any food. Crab and lobster are not too far behind and whitefish like flounder, sole, snapper, halibut and tilapia all have protein percentages above 80%. 
that's pretty impressive. Most fish, like trout and tuna, and shellfish, like scallops and clams, are also mostly protein. Even fatty fish, like salmon, sardines, herring, and anchovies, are 40% protein or more, so they are great options too. So, choose the types of seafood you like best and fit your budget. Yes, it's true that fresh seafood can be expensive. Fortunately, canned and frozen fish and shellfish are nutritious, convenient, budget-friendly alternatives. For instance, you can use fresh, frozen or canned shrimp to make a quick and delicious shrimp salad. My only caution is to avoid or limit high mercury fish like big eye tuna, king mackerel, swordfish and shark. That last one can be a bit dangerous. Otherwise, you really can't go wrong with seafood. Tip number four. Enjoy whole eggs or egg whites. Eggs are a delicious, versatile, budget-friendly food. One common question about them is whether to choose whole eggs or egg whites for weight loss. Egg whites have an extremely high protein percentage of 85%, compared to 34% for whole eggs. Although egg whites provide more protein per calorie, the yolks contain more essential vitamins and minerals. And whole eggs are undeniably tastier than egg whites. So I recommend that you opt for whole eggs alone or in combination with egg whites. Now, whether you prefer your eggs hard-boiled, scrambled, or prepared in an omelette, you really can't go wrong with this protein food. To sum it up, eat all types of poultry with a skin on or off. Go for lean meats like filet mignon, beef sirloin, pork tenderloin, leg of lamb, and all cuts of veal and game. Eat any types of fish and shellfish that fit your preferences and budget, including salmon and other fatty fish. And choose either whole eggs or a combination of whole eggs and whites. And now, what is the number one mistake that could be slowing down your weight loss? Eating too many fatty processed meats. And I'm talking about bacon, sausage, salami and similar processed meats. Yes, they are. Sure, tasty, convenient, but generally speaking, they do not provide much protein per calorie. Can you enjoy them sometimes? Yes, certainly. But if your goal is to lose body fat without feeling hungry, stick with fresh meats most of the time. And select processed meats with higher protein percentages, such as Canadian bacon, turkey bacon, and sausage made from turkey or chicken. If you're on a keto diet and having success, you may not need to switch to leaner cuts. But we feel most people who are looking for weight loss would benefit from choosing processed meats with higher protein percentages. Do you want to learn more about how your favorite meats and seafood rank on the protein percentage scale? See the link below for our visual guide to the best meat, seafood and eggs for weight loss. And for even more information and guidance, sign up for a free trial where you will have access to high protein meal plans with shopping lists, our personalized meal planner, video courses, and many other exclusive member benefits. Find out more at dietdoctor.com. Good luck, and I will see you in our next video.